Hi there, welcome to the 3 Minute Booster and 30 Tools for Productivity. And we're on tool number 27. Define your key performance indicators or KPIs. So that's really sort of MBA kind of stuff, Gabriel. What does defining your KPIs have to do with productivity? It's actually pretty simple. It, it means to find, to find out what's most important for you to make progress in what you want to achieve. Mm-hmm. And it could be different things for different people. In business, you look at your at your numbers, you know, what, what, what is your sales? What are your sales? You know, what, what's the number of money coming into your account? What num- what's the, what the number of sales you made? It could be anything, really. It could be like, um, how frequently did you do your exercise? There is habit trackers you can track. You know, did you do the exercise? Any, how many days in the last week did you do them? Uh, what, what was your intake of calories if you want to do some, some work on, on your weight? So it could be different things. And the important thing is to look at your goals that you have that are most important to you and look at like what are the most important numbers that show if you're making progress or not. Mm-hmm. And, so, and so that's why it's different for different life situations for different positions you're in and the thing is you need to find out like what's the number that you need to track is it the number of people that you called is it the number of um whatever it is you did this it could be the number of steps you walked in a day if you want to move more you can have these fancy apps or whatever it is on your phone so there's different things the important thing is just to, to get aware of like what are the numbers because numbers they give you something really like they are like hard facts, you know, it's like, like you, you can track them over a couple of weeks and you say like, what is the, each week you can look back, like how did I perform this week? And this will help you to analyze where are you falling short? What's getting in the way? Because you can actually see sometimes you feel bad, but everything you did actually well. Other times you feel really great, but you didn't do anything. And so this kind of give you, give you more ob- ob- objectivity to your progress. That's why they are helpful. Mm, I love it. So if, um, if I've never set a KPI, what, what is the call to action for those people? So it is first, do you have goals? If you don't set goals first, if you do have goals, look at how you can make them measurable. Is there a certain amount of steps you need to walk each day? Is there a certain amount of, of times you want to exercise a week? Set a number that you want to commit to. And that's your baseline to start with. And then you can play around with that over time. Mm, I love it. So everyone, get those KPIs done. Share them. um, Like. uh, And uh, we'll look forward to uh, giving you more productivity tools tomorrow. Have a good day. Bye. Bye.